today was our annual gala day. So here at MacArthur Magic Soccer, uh, every year we host a gala day. We invite two or three other special needs clubs to come down, compete against our players, uh, have a few games, have a bit of fun, have a sausage sizzle, and just generally enjoy the morning. I uh, live around the corner from this place, so it's my local community. Um, so to see the program that these people have put in place for these kids, and there's some older boys as well and girls, uh, it's, it's amazing. And I'm trying to be a part of it as much as I can. They need things like this. You see how much fun they had, they all loved it, and it's, it's great. It's great to be a part of it. Oh, they love it, you know, he's a high profile Wanderers player, so it's great having Mark part of this morning, and hopefully we can get him down next season to compete with the kids as well. Um, he's a really good soccer player and I like how he got like heaps of trophies. I have a Wanderers shirt, I have two actually. If you have a son or daughter that is a little bit yeah. out of the norm, you feel like that's okay. It doesn't matter what nationality, what uh, age, what uh, disability or ability you've got. Just let them be kids, let them run, let them be in the sunshine, you know, and they enjoy it so much. Well, it's very important, you know, when we when we created Magic Soccer about six years ago, it was primarily for kids with disabilities who don't really get a chance to play mainstream sport. Um, but we all think as parents, you know, growing up, playing sports a rite of passage. Um, you get up on a Saturday morning, you put your jersey on or your netball uniform and you go and play sports. So we've tried to create that for our kids uh, in an inclusive environment where they can fit in, be themselves, and it's less about scoring goals and winning, but it's about having fun, so. <laughs> I'd, I'd like things like this to have more help. Um, I mean, fully independent at the moment, it's very difficult to, to get the funds you need to, to make it a bigger program. So for big clubs and, and big businesses like the Wanderers to get involved in this and to get awareness to, to things like this, uh, it's, it's huge. You know, we started with 22 kids six years ago. We've got 80, 80 plus kids playing this year. Um, you know, Gala Day every year for us gets bigger and bigger. We probably had about 120 odd kids down here today uh, enjoying soccer and enjoying being out, being part of a team. Oh, oh, brilliant. Uh, I mean, a few of them were telling me that they go for, for Sydney FC, which is, uh, which is interesting. It's funny, but it's, it's normal kids have, have no filter. They love saying what's on their mind and it's, it's, it's brilliant. You wouldn't have it any other way. Oh.